WCNC Charlotte. This is Carolina's News Channel 36. A very good Thursday morning to you. Zooming out just a little bit over the Queen City. Nice look off in the distance as we uh, get ready for the sunrise. In fact, way off on the right-hand side of that picture, I think maybe the sun coming up over the Carolinas. Thanks so much for joining us. We did Thursday. Thursday, right? All right, very good. I'm Jeff Campbell. And I'm Antoinette Flowers. All the earlier, I said Friday, right? You kind of got us hoping and wishing and thinking and maybe so. At least I caught it before I said it on the, on the air. It just needs everybody at home. Right. Thursday morning. Yeah, Thursday morning. And it's a muggy morning out there, too. Let's check in with Larry Sprinkle and find out how long this mugginess is going to be with us, Larry. Uh, probably another maybe six, eight months. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, yeah, it is muggy, but yeah, we'll see some changes shortly. 74 degrees right now, Monroe and Gastonia. Rock Hill, 73, 74 in Mooresville. In the Queen City, we're at 74. Checking that forecast, taking you right through the next seven days. 95 today, close to 95 tomorrow. So we've got a couple hot days here, but the weekend really looks pretty good. Now, maybe a first over two on Saturday. Saturday's high 90, 89. That's right, 89 on Sunday. Low 90s Monday, we're at 93 or so, Tuesday into Wednesday of next week. So we got the humidity and the heat today. So far, so good on the traffic situation. Let's get the latest on that. Here is Brian Sawyer. All right, thanks, Larry. We're holding our own out here. This is uh, northbound uh, 77. We're taking a look at the drive time from the state line uh, to Nathan's Ford, about six minutes right now. That's at its minimum. From there to the John Belk, another minimum drive time, about five minutes. That's uh, 85. Volume increasing a little bit right there now, taking about six minutes rather than five, so about 17 minutes for that whole drive. Out to I-77 at the northern part of I-485. This is up near Huntersville, of course. Uh, 77 southbound between the Lake Norman Cornelius exit and I-85. That current trip time is about 17 or 18 minutes. And the reason why is right here on your screen. No traffic whatsoever. East Independence Boulevard. This is uh, on the ramp uh, to North Wendover Road. A vehicle disabled is in the travel lane right there. Uh, and it is a little slow getting by, but you can't get by there. Police are just arriving on the scene with that wrecker on the way. I'm Brian Sawyer with your News Channel 36 on contract. Just